Hi, I'm Marcy Steyer. I'm the project director of the City of San Diego's Water Purification Demonstration Project. This test project is exploring the use of advanced technology on recycled water to develop a safe and secure water supply for San Diego. Please join me as we tour the facility. The water purification process takes recycled water from the North City Water Reclamation Plant and further treats it through multiple barriers of membrane filtration, reverse osmosis, and ultraviolet disinfection with advanced oxidation. These consecutive treatment steps work together to remove or destroy all unwanted materials in the water. Signage around the facility describes each step of the water purification process. The first step is membrane filtration. Recycled water is pushed by high pressure pumps through filtration membranes made up of thousands of hollow fibers. These fibers have very fine pores that filter out particles, bacteria, and protozoa in the water. We are testing two types of membrane filtration equipment at this facility, ultrafiltration and microfiltration. One million gallons of water passes through this facility each day. The difference between the equipment is that ultrafiltration has smaller pores than microfiltration. Ultrafiltration can remove additional organic matter, but it also operates at a higher pressure and requires more energy to do so. We are testing both processes to determine the most effective approach for long-term operation. Microfiltration and ultrafiltration membranes are tested and monitored daily to confirm the integrity of the membrane filters. This microfiltration canister has been cut open to reveal the hollow fibers inside. The pores on these fibers are so small they cannot be seen by the naked eye. The water at this stage comes together in this 15,000 gallon storage tank. From here, the water moves on to the second barrier in the purification process, reverse osmosis. Water is forced through another set of membranes with even smaller pores, so small that they cannot be measured with even the most sophisticated microscopes. Reverse osmosis removes salt and other materials, many of which are more than 50,000 times smaller than the smallest bacteria or virus. Reverse osmosis is the key treatment step of water purification and is also used to sterilize medicines and baby food without the use of chemicals. We are testing reverse osmosis units from two manufacturers to compare energy usage and overall performance. We are also testing energy recovery devices to reduce the overall energy use by 15 to 20 percent. The energy recovery device uses the hydraulic energy from the waste stream to boost the pressure in the reverse osmosis units. Water is pumped inside these reverse osmosis units. It's then collected in the center tube and it passes through the tightly wound membranes. The reject water is then discharged from the other end of the membrane into the sewerage system. Water quality is tested and monitored in multiple locations throughout the water purification process. Samples are taken at sampling points such as these. As part of our testing and monitoring plan, tests are conducted for hundreds of compounds to ensure this water meets drinking water standards. This includes caffeine, DEET, which is found in mosquito repellent, and triclosane, the ingredient found in hand sanitizers. Online instruments are used for continuous monitoring of the purification equipment. We are now arriving at the third and final barrier at the AWP facility, ultraviolet light with advanced oxidation. Hydrogen peroxide is injected into the water at 10 times the concentration of what we use in our homes. Inside this vessel is ultraviolet light, similar to extremely concentrated sunlight. The hydrogen peroxide reacts with the light to form powerful molecules that destroy any remaining matter in the water. This advanced oxidation process completely disinfects the water. Now that the water has gone through membrane filtration, reverse osmosis, and ultraviolet disinfection with advanced oxidation, the resulting water is clear and similar to distilled water quality. The water from this faucet is the result of the water purification process. As you can see, it's as clear and pure as the water that comes from your tap. It's tested to ensure that it meets all drinking water standards. Currently, 
The water produced at this facility is being added to the recycled water distribution system for irrigation and industrial use. If water purification is approved to go full scale, the purified water would be added to the San Vicente Reservoir and could provide San Diegans with a new local source of drinking water. I hope you enjoyed this tour of our facility. I invite you to visit purewatersd.org to learn more about the facility as well as to schedule a tour. Thanks for coming.